hi everyone and welcome back to my channel if you guys are new hi my name is Elena and I am so happy that you could join us I am a 25 year old mum of four kids and I film budgeting content and lifestyle content over here on my youtube channel so if you guys aren't subscribed Definitely make sure to do so down below. I have a new type of video coming that I have filmed a little bit for you guys this morning. I'm not sure whether you guys will be into that sort of video. So definitely subscribe. Make sure you stay tuned to see that and let me know what you think in the comments down below. If you guys are a returning subscriber, thank you so much for coming back. We are back with another budget with me for this week. So today is Tuesday. Yesterday we had Labor Day. It has been the long weekend. And so we are budgeting for the 25th to the 31st of October. This budget setup is completely different to what I usually do on my channel. It is the exact same method. I haven't changed anything, although it is in the booklet form so if you guys don't know the method that I use is the budget mar method it is the budget by paycheck workbook but it is in the booklet version so I did purchase the box set and it was supposed to be for 2023 but I did want to go ahead and start using it early so I have been using it for the entire month of October and we will see how that goes at the end of the month when I close out my budget. So for my first paycheck, I will be getting $569. And then for my second paycheck, I will be getting $686.91. For my other source of income, I have budgeted $200, and so my income total for this week is going to be $1455.91. Moving on down to my bills, I have Trust Power, which is electricity and my gas. And I budgeted 187 I have already paid this bill and it came out to 187.45. Next I have finance, which is 2718, and I have already paid that this week. Cash converters, it was 3671, but because I have changed the payment date, it has gone up to 3680. I will also be doing a budget with me weekly check-in, so don't you guys worry, but most of these I've already paid this week. Next we have daycare, and as you guys know or don't know if you knew, I have my daughter who is in daycare, but she is going to be staying home with me and my daughter from now on after this week, so the last payment was $60.16 which came out today and she is currently sick at home they had a gastro bug going through the daycare center and so she was asked to have Friday off because they were short staffed which is completely fine and then yesterday she vomited twice so she will be staying home with me until probably Thursday Friday but six dollars and sixteen cents is the last payment then I have Genoa pay at ninety two dollars eighty and the payment for this week is twenty six dollars thirty five I did make the remaining amount payment um, for that the other day so this is just the remaining of the ninety two dollars eighty then we have my car loan at $71.62, we have my rent at $660, we have my car insurance 
it was at 74.78 it has increased to 79.91 because I have included window cover as a part of my car insurance and then if you guys watch the previous video you guys would know that I budgeted water into that video um, weekly budget but it was due this week and so that came out to $99.30 but all together for my total bills I budgeted $1,225.09 and then moving on to my cash envelopes for groceries I budgeted $100 for gas I've budgeted $50 which needs to be increased to $70 miscellaneous $20 family time $10 and emergency $50 so for this week I did budget $230 for my cash envelopes and that is leaving sinking funds with zero. So you guys will be seeing the weekly check-in um, after this video has gone up. Of course some of these um, I will go over in the check-in video as well as fill in the rest of the categories. But I hope that you guys have enjoyed this quick budget with me for this week. I'm hoping November is a better month. Um, I have quite a few things going on in November, which I'm pretty excited for. My daughter is turning nine years old, which is insane to even think that I've been a mum for nine years. And then we have a teacher only day so I'm going to be taking them to the zoo for that. And then I was also able to get a free ticket to another experience place um, that was for free. So I'm going to be taking the two younger girls there during November. So there is quite a bit going on as well as getting my oil change done and having to get my door lock done um, there's just so much that is going on in November so I'm very excited to knock that out of the park get over with Halloween and start decorating for Christmas so I also do have another video coming up after this one I hope that you guys enjoy it it is very different it is very new for me to upload something like this so Please be nice with the comments after you watch it and let me know what you guys think. And that is it for this week. I hope to see you guys in the next video. Make sure that you subscribe and definitely let me know in the comments down below if you guys are going to be doing Halloween, if you are celebrating and if you guys are on a debt free journey, um, how is that going for you guys? So. I will leave you guys with that and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye guys.